What's going on guys? Gus One Bear here. Now I am in the Everglades and I'm going to take the time uh, to show you some of the gear that I take with me when I go out filming and photography. And of course GoPro uh, is a big part of what I use. Whew. And I'm going to show you my GoPro bag. And you're watching Two Bears Outdoors. <laughs> Well guys, I'm gonna show you my camera bag. And this is my in-case Kelly Slater bag. The reason why I chose the in-case instead of the GoPro Seeker, uh, don't get me wrong, I love the GoPro Seeker. The thing is that there was a game changer. Um, I like to use my GoPro. I also like to take my DSLRs. So the GoPro Seeker really didn't have much space for all the gear that I take with me. So I'm going to show you some of the cool stuff that I'm able to carry. Depending on the type of shoot that I'm doing, the equipment changes as well. But today, I'm out here filming. Just getting some footage of the Everglades, some of the animals, and uh, it is hot. The NK Kelly Slater is pretty much water resistant. Um, I've had this in a lot of rain. Actually, I had a lot of rain today. Um, everything stays dry, of course. It's not submersible, so, but I think if you, if it does take a dunk, if you can recover quickly, it uh, shouldn't be too bad. And I love this material. They call this the Dolphin Gray. And if you turn it around, uh, it's got another side pocket here. And this is just a quick view of what I have. Um, on the straps itself, they have a place for your GoPro, which makes it very handy. Here on the side, it's got a side pocket, which I normally use. Uh, this right here and that kind of works out pretty good now on the inside whew, the inside as you can see it's got a pocket here I use it for my I use it for my selfie sticks um, tripods stuff like that it works pretty well I got most of the stuff already out <laughs> That I've been using it to film, but I have uh, bags, accessories. Um, I mean, it's got a lot of space. Now, normally when you buy this bag, it comes with other accessories. Um, apparently, I got this at a cheaper price, and it was just the bag itself. It did come with this, where you could put your GoPros in here. But normally, the kit comes with other bags and stuff like that. I'm um, not going to lie to you, it is a costly bag, more than the GoPro Seeker. Uh, $350, $250. I got this um, a little cheaper, let's just say. But it was bare bones, just the bag, which I'm happy. Um, I could always buy the accessories later on. And uh, it does give me a lot of space uh, to put the stuff that I need. My power bank, this top compartment here. And of course, this has an area for me to put my, my Nikon D5200. If I want to put my D7200, I can. I got a 55-200 millimeter lens. Plenty of space. Well, basically, when I go out trekking, I can pack a lot of stuff, including lunch, water bottles, everything. Just here. My other attachments and stuff. I could put this bag, which is basically a Kodiak reel from Cast King. I think I should take this along with me. This is the bag where I put my the camera that I'm using to film goes back in there I mean really there's a lot of space and of course my sunglasses which I'm rocking them right now as you can tell I mean you could really fit a lot of stuff so I got my DSLR camera I got all my GoPro attachment my fishing reel I got everything that I would need 
It also has this bungee, which I could pack and I could strap stuff to it. And also, that's a Casking telescopic rod. This is the Ranger. Now I can actually put my fishing pole here. Everything gets strapped in. Got my camera. Got my camera. And I'm ready to go. Boy, it's getting real bad. Guys, I normally carry with me a who rag for situations like this. <sighs> One thing that I cannot stand is mosquitoes buzzing in my face and getting into my ear. So I always carry a couple who rags with me. Um, man, they keep the sun off of you and definitely keep the bugs off of you. So that's just a, a quick view of what I normally take with me, especially when I go out in the Everglades. Uh, the bag is comfortable, I think is well worth the money. And again, one day I'll probably purchase the Seeker, the GoPro Seeker that is. But uh, guys, y'all take care. This is Gus One Bear, and you're watching Two Bears Outdoors. eating bugs.